This episode of The Young Turks is brought to you by Squarespace. Barack Obama is going to explain his bad rap. Get ready for a full face palm. Let's watch. Now, keep in mind, I've just gone through two years, Chuck, where the rap on me was I was too stubborn and wasn't willing to budge on a whole bunch of issues, <laughs> including, by the way, health care, where everybody here was writing about how, despite public opinion and despite this and despite that, somehow the guy's going to bulldoze his way through this thing. Well, so that's now, that's well, well, not happy well, but that's my point. But my, my point is I don't make judgments based on uh, what the conventional wisdom is at any given time. I make my what judgments based on what I think is right for the country and for the American people right now. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, I will be happy to see the Republicans test uh, whether or not uh, I'm itching for a fight on a whole range of issues. Uh, I suspect they will find I am. Uh, and I think the American people will be my, on my side on a whole bunch of these fights. But right now, I want to make sure that the American people aren't hurt because we're having a political fight. And uh, I think that this agreement uh, accomplishes that. I literally did it, man. The first time I watched it, when he said, oh, I got a bad rap for, you know, because I'm not willing to budge against the Republicans. So I was like, I did a double. <laughs> really? No, and that's a great irony. Is it's the exact opposite of what he, what he said right after. He says, oh, you know me. I don't listen to conventional wisdom. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's all you do. The reason you think you have a bad rap for not budging against the Republicans is because of Washington conventional wisdom. No one else in the country thinks that. No one. Only the people that circle you in Washington who are like, oh, boy, <laughs> take it easy, Barack. You've been killing them over there. Oh, the way you've been tough against those Republicans. Way too tough. You better ease up. <laughs> you don't listen to conventional wisdom. Oh, what a sad joke. And then, again, to build on that irony, he says, oh, now I'm itching for a fight. What, you know, the one here where you had 67% of the American people with you, that might have been a good fight. That doesn't look like you're itching for a fight. And But you know what happened? Conventional wisdom changed, as I showed to, uh, you on the show yesterday. Now conventional wisdom is he's not fighting enough, right? So he's like, oh, yeah, wait till the next time when I will pretend to fight. Ah, it's going to be sad to watch. You, I, here, chalk it up now, man. I can see the clips now where Obama comes out and gives a fake tough guy speech about, oh, I'm going to stand my ground, blah, 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 blah. And it's going to be on something meaningless. It's going to be, oh, I wish I weren't so right. <laughs> I mean, come on. It's, this is a joke, man. Politicians, man. New sponsor at the Young Turks, Squarespace. They help you build websites. They've got 24-7 support, and they've built some of the largest websites in the world. They have an iPhone app, so you can edit your website on the go. TYT promo code, 10% off for the life of your order. Squarespace.